In today's kitchen, there are six different types of soup. These sorts are divided into two groups, clear soup and thick soup. Consomme, bouillon, and broth are examples of transparent soups. Purees, velouté, cream, and other are examples of thick soup. Clear soups are delicate soups that do not contain any thickening agents. A traditional type of a clear soup is consomme, a French clarified meat or fish broth. Another transparent soup is broth, sometimes known as bouillon. Broths are available in a range of flavors, such as chicken, turkey, beef, vegetable, and mushroom. Contrary to popular belief, transparent soups can pack a punch of flavor. Soups that are clear do not taste watery. Clear soup can provide a variety of nutritional benefits while also keeping your intestines clear. This is why clear soup is so popular in hospitals and as a comfort dish when you're sick. Bouillon and broth. Many chefs and journalists interchange the phrases broth and bouillon. This is understandable given that they are both essentially the same, a water-based soup with bones, meat, fish, or vegetables simmered in it. Allow for ample time for the gelatin to thicken, resulting in a tasty stock. Ground meats, mirepoix, carrots, celery, and onion, tomatoes, and egg whites are combined in either bouillon or stock to make consomme. The secret to making a high-quality consomme is to simmer it. Impurities rise to the top as a result of the boiling and stirring, and the acid from the tomatoes draws them out even more. The solids eventually coagulate at the liquid surface, forming a raft, which is generated by the proteins in the egg whites. The outcome is a transparent liquid with a deep amber or yellow color. The fat is skimmed from the surface after it is carefully processed through a filter to assure purity. Soups thickened with flour, cornstarch, cream, veggies, and other components are known as thick soups. You can obtain varying textures and flavors depending on how you thicken a soup. A potage of boiling meat and vegetables, for example, produces a thick mushy soup. A bisque, on the other hand, is thickened with rice, resulting in a smoother soup. Bisque. A bisque is a rich, creamy soup made with seafood. Bisque is a technique for extracting flavor from crabs, lobsters, and shrimp that aren't fit for market. The shells are pounded to a fine paste and added to the soup to thicken it in an authentic bisque. Rice is used to thicken bisques, and it can either be strained out, leaving the starch behind, or pureed in the final stages. Cream. Cream of. Soups are the most common type of soup available in Campbell's condensed soup cans and come in a range of flavors. Cream soups are generally made using a simple roux that has been diluted with cream or milk and blended with a broth of your choice. Cream of tomato soup, cream of mushroom soup, and cream of chicken soup are all common flavors. The inclusion of cream results in a substantial and flavorful soup that is thick and pleasant. Potage. Potage is a northern French medieval soup was usually cooked for several hours until the texture and flavor of the entire combination was uniform. Its purpose was to break down complicated carbohydrates and verify that the food was safe to eat. That was all about the types of soup. Hope you liked the video. Please do like, share and subscribe our channel Explified.